welcome to BTFL. It's your man Earl, Batman Stringer. And in this video, I got a quick review. All right, we reviewing the Calo silicone ring right here. Uh, I recently just got married. Congratulations to me. That's right, that's right. Settled down off the market, okay? But anyway, so, uh, I actually, I got the, my actual wedding ring, you know, the metal ring, right? But because I'm so active, like I work out all the time, I'm always grabbing the the, the dumbbells or, or, or the barbell or something, right? I didn't want to wear my metal ring all the time. And my wife is like, you need to wear the ring all the time. Blah, 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 blah. So I was like, yo, why don't you get me one of them silicone rings and I wear it all the time, right? So uh, about a week after the wedding, I actually got this, uh, which is the Calo, which I ended up say it for the longest time, but the Calo silicone. This is the thicker band. You see, this is like the navy blue. All right. So, what do I think about it so far? Getting straight to the point, I love it. All right. Especially when you compare it to wearing uh, the the traditional, you know, the metal wedding ring. To me, I like it. Um, I've seen a couple other reviews where, you know, some people getting into details like, yo, you know, water gets underneath and it felt uncomfortable and it wears on your skin. Eh, maybe, you know what I'm saying? But me personally, I haven't had an issue with it. I've only been wearing it for about a month now anyway. So maybe in a couple months, I might have a different take on it. But right now I like it. And why I really say that, because when I worked out with it, I didn't feel it. You know what I mean? Just like initially, I felt it a little bit, but overall, like once I start working out or anything, I don't even feel it. I mean, I can box with this on, I can pick things up. I don't even notice it. It's still in really great shape in my opinion. Um, I'll actually even take it off real quick and show you. It's easy to take off. All right, you see it, boom, try to get close on it. All right, that's what it looked like. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, now, here's the thing where I seen some people talk about the size. Honestly, if I was you, if you're going to get it online, follow the actual uh, company's chart. I guess they got a chart to figure out what, what size you should get. Or if you go get them in person, like I got this one from uh, Dick's. Well, my girl, she actually got it online. But I actually tried these on in Dick's because they got the little circle thing you can actually try on to determine what size you need. Now, I've seen other videos where guys, one guy was saying that they're true to size. So if you wear a size 11 in metal ring, you should get 11 in the uh, the, the Kalo, Kylo, whatever you say it. Now, somebody else was like, nah, if you wear 11 in um, the metal rings, you should get a size smaller, right, with the Kylo. And I'm kind of, I don't know, I'm completely different. Like, I wear, I believe, 11 in my metal ring right and this is a nine and this feels super comfortable um with it on and my metal ring is super comfortable when i wear that so honestly the whole take on what size should you get that's up to you because i think just because different people wear you know they like some people like their rings a lot tighter than other people right some people like a little more looseness to it i just like my comfortable to my life all right but Overall, I love this this ring. You know, it lets you know, bam, it lets you know your boy married, bam, bam, bam. And uh, I rarely take it off. Um, there's no real reason to take it off. I know other people say, I, I, I still take it off from time to time. I, I t I've taken this off maybe once in the last three, four weeks, but I don't know. But uh, overall, I like it. I got this, uh, well, you can get these online. Uh, I believe they sell them on Amazon for around 20 bucks. Um, you can also get them at Dick's Sporting Goods because that's where I originally saw these at and they're about the same price. All right, so I know they have like the Groove Life rings too. Maybe I might try one of them uh, in the future, but this Kylo, I'm feeling it. You know what I'm saying? It's not bad at all. I like the way it feels. So if you're thinking about getting one or you a lady, think about getting one for your dude, I think it's a good, it's a good deal. All right, so that's my take on it. Comment below, let me know if you got one of these or you got another brand. 
Let me know what you think. Till the next time. Peace.